there folks and welcome into my channel. I'm in today, I have a bit of a haul for you. So I'll go through the haul, most of it's from the range, Timu and a few bits from eBay. It's just coming into autumn as we call it, fall for my American friends. So I bought this ribbon here, I bought it in the range and I paid a pound for it and there's a metre of each one in there and it's just the different colours of leaves as you can see, it's quite nice, it's a nice wee trim. This one here was 99 pence from the range and it's a velvet ribbon and it absolutely, it feels lovely although I don't really like the feeling a velvet but it's a beautiful colour and I'm going to make some wreaths and it will go nice in the wreaths for ribbons this one here again I'm not sure if this was one ninety nine or 99p but it's a beautiful it's ribboned you know so as you can shape it eh, no ribbon sorry wired at the sides so as you can shape it do what you want to do with it and it's quite sparkly it's quite nice so got that one again, that's the range. Just tape it up to save it unraveling. Um let me see if there's anything else from the range. Yeah, we've got quite a few things here. I bought two double-sided tapes, um, they were a pound each. I was running out of double-sided tapes, so I got some of them. I bought Two packs of these um, polystyrene balls. That one's already been opened, and there's 36 in a pack, and they were 169 for a pack. I'm sure, it was 169. But my intention is to do this type of thing. This one's no finished, but I've just put the wee balls onto a wire put some glue on them and I've put some glitter on but I was in a hurry just to see what it looked like obviously it's not finished but I'm going to that'll go for some picks for my reeds oops let me see just sorry about that the camera just fell there bought three of this ribbon here. I take my ribbon off the spools and I keep them like that so I can put them, just close them like this in my drawer and it's easier to stack than loads of them with a load of wasted space because when you pop it open you can see how much space is in it. That was 99 pence and there is two metres on it and it's just a sparkly ribbon it's soft it's no jaggy or anything it's a nice soft one again that's going to go and make some picks these two here were a pound each it's just the red and the green inch satin ribbon I've got 60 pipe cleaners and these were a pound as well and it's just different colours I wanted the brown ones to go and I'm going to do um, a gingerbread wreath so and neither the pound at uh, neither the time I'm sure the pound shop get in uh, pipe cleaners and they're more Christmassy but I just got that while I was there these I'm not sure how much these were I think they were a pound but it's the wee spider rings, but I don't use them as rings. I'll cut them up and put them on wreaths or cards or my treat packets or something like that for Halloween. I'll just get it out and show you. There's a whole load in here. See, see the wee wreath, the wee ring, like that. Again, I think they were a pound, and there's 80 in the pack, so that was quite good. Let me close this up, or they'll be everywhere. There we go. 
school. I bought a big roll of jumbo, there it's there, you can see, white giant soft touch yam. It's like jumbo chenille. It was £6.49 and there is 234 metres in that. Absolutely loads. It says 4 99 Somehow I thought it was 6 49 but it says 4 99 on there. So if it was 4 99 that was a good deal. I bought those glue sticks because the first day I was in that was all they had and they were a pound. And these ones here are the same glue, stri glue sticks but there's only 12 in that for a pound. And there's 50 in that for £3.74. And I was needing glue sticks because I've kind of run out. And I bought this rope trim. It was a pound something, but I don't remember what the something was. It was the £2. It was like £1.69 or something like that. From the range as well. Right, so that's all the stuff from the range. And today it's our local festival and it's called, it's spelled Mary Mass, M-A-R-Y-M-A-S-S, but we call it Murmus. And it's all based on the carters who used to deliver stock through the harbour on their horse and carts and it's all based on that. It's the largest horse drawn parade in Europe, I think. Anyway, I made a wreath. Oh, and I got this in the range. Sorry, I put that up there and I forgot. This is a 12 by 12 paper pack, 24 sheets. I'm sure, there it's there, 3 99 I was going to say. I'm sure it was 3 99 But they've upped their game this year. It's a lot better than previous years. Skulls and the pumpkins. You get two each. Pink kind of ghosts is a big theme. That is quite popular, but it's a big theme just now, isn't it? And there's your pumpkins. And when you get the two double pages in the middle, I thought, oh, it's just going to repeat. But it doesn't. It's different. It's a bit more grown-up pad. A lot of the pads before were really quite babyish. So I bought that. I'll use that for treat boxes and stuff for the kids. Because we're going to do the house again this year. So once I've done it, I'll decorate and show you. These here, these were one ninety nine, and they were from Home Bargains. I'll open this up for you. There's three bits in this. And as usual, I had to ask her the price, because Home Bargains are terrible for not putting their prices on. It's tied together with a bit of black ribbon. If you can hear any music in the background, it's the fairground as some people call it and we call it the shows. The shows are on. Cut that off there. There's actually five pieces in it. There you go. I thought there was only three pieces in it. And it's just twigs with bats on. Now I'm gonna you can sissy them up and fancy them up. There's a highlighter pen there. And that's just a wee plain bat there, but if you can highlight some of the edges. dogs were barking. Nope. You know, you can alter it. You can put glitter on them. Do what you like. Just puts a wee bit of life back into it. By the time you put a wee bit of glitter or something like that on there. Oh, 
that'll go for my wreath I've got. And see these wee bits? That you can get flowers and stuff and stick it on there. Because that's just a wee universal end. So that's quite good. And I can put my own bats on because I've got dyes and I've got bat shapes and stuff. Right. I got these paper straws. There is 250 paper straws in there for £6.50. They just came there. That's what my dogs were back. Well, just before I come out here, my dogs were barking. Eh, they're always barking. 250 for £6.50 from eBay. And that's for when I make my Christmas picks in my wreath. The straws will go over the stem and it'll hide the skewer that you put them on. Okay. Right, this is quite a big bag. I've got a few of the same thing in different colours. Right, I get some of this. This is like tinsel. It's you know the stuff that you get in America, you get all your wreath shapes in the Dollar Tree and it's covered with the tinsel stuff. This is the tinsel stuff that's on the wreaths. Right? This was 179, but I think there's either two or three meters on a row. And I bought these in Halloween colours. I've got orange and purple, and I think there's a green one somewhere else in the bag. So let's see if we can see. Oh, there it's there. There's a green one as well. Right, that's to go for Halloween picks. Now, I bought this wool and I bought it off of Timu and I have to say, it's really good. I wasn't expecting it to be as good. Now, remember the one that I showed you? I paid three ninety nine for. Alright, okay, it's maybe double the size. But I paid three ninety nine for that. It's the same thickness, guys. It's exactly the same. This is Timu's and this is the the range one, remember. The Timu one I paid let me find one my price on it. $1.99. Right, I paid $1.99 and I'm not sure. There's a hundred grams of wool in it, but I don't remember the meterage. I think it was like two hundred something for the, the meterage that's in it, but for one ninety nine, come on. They didn't have white, so I bought that cream thinking that it would do, and I don't think it will do. It's a bit off, as you see. Also bought it in black and in red. And I did make a wee pick the other day, but I'm just, I've misplaced it and I don't know where I put it. So, that was, that's the rule for that. And these, and I'm waiting loads of other stuff coming. I'm waiting on an eBay order. Um, I'm waiting on an Amazon order. I bought these bee balls here. They're all the same size. And I got a hundred of them for 85 pence. And that is actually that size there. The kind of bigger one. That's the wee tiny one. And the big one. And that one out of the packets for... Uh, the range and that's the ones for there okay I hate that glitter it gets everywhere okay and the ribbon and this is Christmas ribbon I'm going to try and do a Grinch wreath this year open. Yeah, it's, it's in that many bags I didn't see where it opens. So I was on Timu and I bought loads of different ribbons. I'm waiting on another Timu order coming, my, my eBay order coming. They're supposed to be nine metres in these. And it's red. Oh, that stuff over there. Oh, that's so sporty. It's red with the white along the side and again it's wired so you can shape it to suit. 
that that was the expensive. I think that was one ninety nine. Oh no, it was four fifty five. But there's nine meters, which was okay. And do you know what it feels like? It feels like remember years ago when you used to get the wee Santa ornaments and all that, the wee rubbishy ones. They used to kind of have a fake beard and move. Well, that's the kind of velvet it is. It's no proper velvet. It's like velveteen. Get in there. So, I've got that. Is that me? I think that might be me. Oh no. I got this here. This was 149 and it was for the range. It was just in a different bit and there's 10 yards in that. And it's obviously 6 inch. But that would do for deco mesh. See if you were in a pickle. Although our deco mesh, it's not the same. It's no rigid or anything. The American deco mesh holds its shape better. Ours is just like netting and the glitter falls off it. It's horrendous. See, it's quite soft. And you have to put it in a bag once you open it because the glitter goes absolutely everywhere. So, uh -huh, I am going to be doing a wreath. I'm going to be doing a couple of wreaths actually. So, if you're interested in that and you want to come along for the ride, drop me a message and I'll share it. If I don't get any comments saying yes please or whatever, then I'm not going to bother. But if you want to see it, I'll do it. Jesus, the glitter's everywhere. I'm going to do some Halloween treat bags and gift boxes because I've got a load of new dyes for that. So, if you want to see any of them, give me a message as well. I think that's all. I think that's all everything that I've got just lately. Oh no, I've got loads of this glitter stuff. I've already put that away. Oh, I bought these. These are 40 pence a sheet in the range as well. Oh, there's a parade heading out to the park now. I can hear the music. For Lorna, if you're watching, that's the Mummers Parade going along Cowanin Road, Lorna. Lorna. I can't remember. I'm sure it's Lorna. One of my subscribers used to stay no far from me, actually, just around the corner. But we never realised that till long after she had moved. So this is the foam green. I've, I've just bought this to die cut and make some picks and that for Christmas. I've got three of each. I get three of the green, three of the red, three of the brown. I couldn't get the white glitter, so I got three of the silver glitter. It does shed, but it's no massive. You know, there's not a lot that comes off it. And as I said, they were 40 pence a sheet. I think the glitter ones were 40 pence too. Because I didn't see a different price on it. Right, that's all my purchases. So I'm going to love yous and leave yous at that. I, I've, I'm in the mood to go and get some things. Oh! These ribbons here. These are my specialty ribbons. I've got them up with my special ribbons. I bought these from Wreaths. USA to UK Wreaths. That's what it was called, on Etsy. Okay. She imports them in big rolls and then she divvies them up. These were expensive. These these were expensive. Okay. You fluff it up. You shake it and fluff it up. Or whatever. But it's like, it's like feathers. It's like furry. Obviously, you know, for the green monster. I'm going to do that and that's going to be a curly curly pick like that to go in a, a, a wreath for nine meters of that it was 15 pound okay so again it is quite expensive so you kind of watch what you're doing with the ones 
and this one here was also £15 for 9 metres but you'll not get that here you just won't get it you're a mean one okay and it just keeps repeating after that this is wired again, you can shape it. Is that one wired? Yep, the fluffy one's wired as well. £15 for 9 metres and then my deliveries. I think it was about £30-something pound all in. Which I get it, it's quite a considerable purchase. And all that. But I don't drink and I don't smoke. And I don't go with dirty men, so that's my treat. I treat myself to craft stuff. Right, okay, listen, I'm going to love these and leave these. I'll maybe nip out and see our festival. Um, I should have videoed it, but again, I didn't have to this morning. I couldn't be bothered. If you like the wee video, give me a like and subscribe. Tell your friends where I am. Share the love, and I hope to take you along on my next journey. And I'll see you all again the next time. Bye!